hi everyone welcome back to the my channel my name is anil and in this just video tutorial we will see that how we can test a object all right so here you can see that i have a function and in the return value i am just going to return a object so let's say it's like this name is anil all right so how can how can i test this object so for that uh, for making the test case first of all i am just going to make a test file so just write here some dot test dot js file all right so you can put any name of your file but the file extension should be test dot js if you don't if you just want to make a test case otherwise this will not going to count inside a test case so first of all let's take a variable sum and get the uh, this function some function inside here so let's just write here required and in the required just write put the path of file all right and now the sum function we have inside the sum constant so i'll just put here sub test function as you know that it will take the two parameter one for the test message like uh, object testing and the second will be a callback function for to match right so here i am just going to write here expect function and in this we have to pass the function name which is sum and now we have to check to equal and it should be the same as our object output right so this is the output and here we can just make the like same here now let's check is it fine or not so just write here npm test or uh, npm run test and now let's see what we will get here now you can see that test case is passed here so if i am just going to make something wrong like peter then it will just give a error to us so now let's see what kind of error it will just provide now when you just run it you will find that uh this should be the output and but the function output is this all right and this is telling that the issue is with this line and all all right and uh, this is expression and everything so this is how that we can just test a function output as an object so don't forget to subscribe my channel in the upcoming videos we will learn a lot like how we can just test the async data apis and mock functions how we can make and all thanks for watching this video don't forget to subscribe my channel